evening to you and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town and uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too and uh, all of it adds up to make a terrific a crackling atmosphere the match i think will be quite a spectacle so what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game looking forward to seeing this a capacity crowd here yes Peter it's a shame it's only a, a friendly but then again that may help us see a more expressive attacking contest and I'd be prepared to settle for a, a clash of, of lesser intensity in favor of of lots of flair skill and plenty of tricks and a few goals I suspect I've probably overstretched my my level of greed here Gets things running. So, Jim, tell me this. Who are you looking for in particular here? Yeah, Casemiro. He gives them some real defensive steel in the middle of the park, Peter. What he's particularly good at is nipping opposition attacks in the bud and preventing them from getting any real momentum going. He's also a bit of a shooting threat from long range too. So opposing defences will have to beware of that, and very much so. Yeah, I'd have picked him too. No doubt the fans feel much the same way. Juan Bissaka demonstrating fabulous determination. He just will not be beaten. Going through. Greenwood! Modric. Hoists it forward. Van der Beek. Vinicius Junior, he's played him through, now it's Benzema, it's Benzema! He's done very well to get to that. Oh, that's a sparkling save, absolutely sparkling, his reflexes were ultra sharp. Looks to thread it through. And that's been won straight back. Maguire. It's Rashford. Fence has got rid of that. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. That'll be a throw. Greenwood. were asked but he's given the answers and it's played forward Benzema pings it out wide Sergio Ramos more than happy to take the muscular approach at the bank. One Bissaka. One Bissaka hits that long. It's come and the shot! Goal! Manchester United! There is the 
breakthrough. Time and space are plenty, he was never going to miss. And that's what the game is all about. Find space and finish, but we have to credit the pastor to pick him out. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. Truthfully, it was hard to see any better outcome there. Van der Beek goes looking. Courtois catches it safely. Van der Beek. Well, that's clearly not what he wanted to do. Benzema. A real chance if he can get through. Vinicius Junior. Goes for the cross. Not had too much on it. the final action of the first half. And here we are, off they go for half-time. The great move did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It was very, very tight. Well, this team has found a real rhythm to their game. The players seem to have clicked well, there's good movement off the ball, the passes are sticking. No one's afraid to have a go. Manchester United head into the dressing room, pleased with the thought that they have that all-important lead. Analysis to come during the break. We are already promptly back on the way. Well, 1-0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. Van der Beek has got himself a free kick. Juan Bissaka has created one goal already. Van der Beek. Azar. Sergio Ramos. Away from immediate danger. Van der Beek. Alex Tellez clips one through. Manchester United are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. So that's two now without reply. Well, with this kind of authority, Peter, why not push on and, and totally kill this off? Lindelof gets into the right position to intercept. Ball through needs to be good here. Azar! He's pulled off a fine save. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. Rashford can hoist it clear. Dinks one in. Van der Beek. Valverde hits it back. Modric. Hazard. 
And here's it's Benzema! Oh, another save. Benzema clearly thought he'd done enough. The save was like a bolt from the blue. Modric with the short one. Isco. Looking cross field, changing the point of attack. And he's going long. Bruno Fernandes. Real Madrid uh, keeping their men at arm's length here. Yeah, I just think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. Rashford! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Rashford put absolutely everything he had into that. Maybe better look next time. Around with the crossfield ball. But Lindelof sends it forward. Valverde. He's looked long this time. Rashford. Rafael Varan just did a brilliant job there. It was one of those all or nothing commitments, and he came up front. Modric plays it forward. It's Isco! Really well taken goal. Absolutely thundered in. Keeper, no chance. Oh, the contact was fantastic. Right on the bootlaces and it packed a lot of venom for what was a really potent strike. Time for changes on both sides, actually. This is threatening to become a really good game. I think they've done so well to get back in it, but it's important now that they don't become over-eager in chasing another. They only need one more chance. Patience is key. Hazard. Benzema! Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue the situation, and it needs to be any time now, really. Rashford. It's Cavani! Manchester United probably could have killed things off, but they should be OK here. It is just a question of running down the clock now. So that's it. It is all over. Manchester United winners by the odd goal. Really could have gone either way, but a win is a win. And after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? Manchester United won thanks to a, 